The City of Vintuk's community meeting was also attended by officials from the Ministry of Gender Equality, Poverty Eradication and Social Welfare and the City Police to address the plight of the residents. Residents were educated on how to deal with and settle their utility accounts, processes one needs to engage in to access social grants, as well as inquiring on national identity documents. For us, it's also to take stock whether they are also satisfied with the service they are receiving from the constituency, and also for us to improve uh, where we need to give service or where we need to engage them. The City of Vintuk's assistant accountant at the Debt Management Division, Elsa B. Bok, urged the residents with outstanding balances to settle their accounts. Bok also warned them against illegal connections of water and electricity. Visit our offices. We have our head office. Um, we have Suweto office. Um, and also the Okuringawa office where you can visit the office and make arrangements on your outstanding account. In order to do that, your current account is always fully payable, plus an extra amount on the outstanding debt. Please do not let the city come to your house before you come to the city. The Ministry of Gender Equality, Poverty, Eradication and Social Welfare updated the residents on the increment of social and disability grants for adults from 1,300 to 1,400. Disability grant for children under the age of 16 has moved up from 250 to $1,400, while orphans and vulnerable children will now get a monthly grant of $350. On safety matters, the city police urged the public to report domestic violence and other criminal acts. Breaking remain a concern because it's also now winter, it's getting dark very early, so uh, criminals are also using this opportunity. And domestic violence. Domestic violence most of the times is caused by the contributing factor of uh, domestic violence is alcohol. A lot of the issues are being raised while uh, people are under the influence. Let's say a relationship, it can be brother, sister, wife, uh, and husband, and so forth. So on that note, we are calling on our public to use our office. We have a unit called uh, the, um, Victim Support Unit. Let's not suffer in silence.